This isn't Crusader Kings 3. No one said anything about Viking Raiders and Football Manager. G'day there, gang. Welcome back to the Chump Champ. I'm Wales, but most people call me Wally. Today, we are back with our Euro 2 clash against AIK. That's right, the Swedish Warriors are coming down here to take us on at home in the first leg of our home and away elimination playoff against them. Since we last come to you, we've only had the one game against Ostenda, and we, yeah, it was a 1-1 draw. We should have done better than that. We were ahead for a long portion of the game here, and then we conceded late into the game. But there was, you see, there were some good performances across the board for us there, but that leaves us going into today needing this win for form reasons to take back into the league and also so we could get a nice little cushion against these guys before we go play them away. So today we have Tosi in goal. Uh, the back four is Ganaka, Verbugi, Popovic and Vletnik, my standard uh, Euro back four. Uh, Canute and the Silva Lopez steps in because Bella Marquis is a bit on the tired side after his last game in the league. Uh, Mohamed Romero uh, Rubio, who is really, really, really settling into the side, um, has scored in the league and in the Euro Cup for us now. So he is well and truly away and a dinky ahead of those guys. I just realized I've had my headset on. Have I jinxed it? You reckon I jinxed it? Yeah, I think so too. Should have left it on. Should have left it on. Has that reset the... I don't know. I've already walked away from the computer once. I've walked away from good RNG and come back to a loss that draw against Ostender. So I'm already a bit eyebrow raising against the RNGs at the moment. Right, we're going to pump the fist, get the boys out there. This one seems to be working well at the moment. I'm going to send the assistant to the tunnel interview. I've been monitoring my media handling and I do just enough interviews to keep it maxed out. So that saves me from going completely insane answering the same questions every week professional football managers worldwide who basically answer the same questions from the same journalists every week i dip my hat to you guys anyway popovich is on the ball for us here and he pushes forward for the silver lopez lenting can cross a ball so can rubio though we've seen that facundo rubio what genius can he produce here? He gives the ball to Mohamed, and Mohamed back across the face goal, and to Silva Lopez has no problems tapping that one home, and we are off to an excellent start here against the AIK. It's less than two minutes into the game, and we've already scored. I'm kind of thinking that, I don't know, have I, again, gone overkill and played too many league, too many people that should be playing in the league to get us into the will get us into Europe again and in these games and and should be resting them. It's hard to tell. It's hard to tell. I, I, I've kind of got my heart set on chasing this Europe thing now. It, it's going really well. Right, tear or tear. Goes up the middle and Svensson with the ball to Falstrom. They are, they're, they're good Viking names, these guys. Now, uh, if we could relieve them of the ball, gentlemen, that would be good. I've had a couple of scout reports come back on some of the guys I was a bit iffy on on the transfer market. Uh, a couple of them look good. So we might have a potential target or two to sign up before the end of the season and pre-arrange a transfer fee with some of the money we've got left now. Mohammed with a lovely ball for Romero here. Romero's in, cuts it across for Denki, and Denki makes no mistake with those. He puts that away and puts us 2-0 up here. What a fantastic start to this game. It's only six minutes in. It's only six minutes in. But look at this though. Oh, see, we can. We're great against the terrible sides, aren't we? Look at that. That's the easiest this Romero will have in his life, and it's the easiest tapping Denki will get all season. What's Rubio find ahead here now? Yep. Um, the Rubio corner seems to be seems to be a thing. Uh, Rubio to uh, Vibruga slash um, uh, Milosevic seems to, seems to be a goer. Oh, I think we're going to see good results from that. And it makes me want to put the um, the set piece training back into the training routine. At least the attacking corners one. Anyway, Vibruge, the aforementioned with the ball. Him and Canute tap it around a bit. And we're all the way back to Tosi here. Uh, we, uh, the boys are being patient, but a, a, a little bit more penetration would be nice here, boys. Right, Popovich brings it out. The Silva Lopez plays a lovely ball for Mohamed. Mohamed plays an even lovely ball for Denki. 
think you can't quite finish it, but we get a corner. Rubio hooks the ball in and Verbugas. What have I told you? Yep. That is going to trouble them the entire game. The big lad Verbuga there on the near post. All right. Ganaka with the ball. Romero locks it all the way back to Popovich. And Ganaka with plenty of space here to cut the ball across. And this time it's Rubio on the back stick. Well, we're dismantling these boys. This is a bit sad. I, I've... I've stacked the team the wrong way. I've stacked the team the wrong way. Right, I'm going to get some of these starters off as soon as possible. Especially if we score another goal, that's it. Some of these boys are coming off early, early doors. All right, bit of a quiet spell now. But I'm still looking at bringing some of these guys off. It's, yeah, it, it, it's not worth, it's not worth it. We, we need the league position. Romero. Knackers puts the ball in and oh, there's not quite one of our heads on the end of it. There's an AIK head on the end of it, in fact. And that's the end of the highlight. The Silver Lopez, um, proving my faith in him, giving him a start in the central midfielder position. It's one of his favourite positions, the centre midfielder on attack. I don't think stat-wise he's quite there. Mohamed, oh, that's a lovely ball across. And Rubio puts in his second of the game. And he's paying back every cent, this guy, already. I really, really like Facundo Rubio. I just like saying Facundo Rubio. What, what a great name. Right up there with the best guy that hasn't had to be renamed so far in um, volleyball history. Right, this is terrible for them. Right, come on, Rubio, get your hat trick so I can get you off. Romero. <coughs> Wow. And that's Hitchin Muhammad getting on the scoreboard there as well. Excuse me. I have a bit of a sore throat. I'm hoping it's not the Rona. I'll be having to do a rat test before I go to work in the morning. And I really, really hope it's not the Rona. But fingers crossed it's not. Muhammad nods that one home easily. And we're 5 0 up. That's it. I'm resting people. I'm resting people. Right, two changes here. We've brought off Kevin Denke for support slot. And Gnaka has come off for Adoa Basok. Um, the other change I'd like to make would be it would be um, Jerry Peters for either Rubio or Mohammed, probably Rubio. Hopefully Rubio finishes off his hat trick, and then I can just bring him off. Right here we go. Uh, what a dismantling this has been. Um, I might not bother bringing you with, with the return leg. I might bring you a, a league match next instead, rather than bringing you the return leg because this is um, all but done. You would think. Let's just bring um, Jerry Peters on there for the last half an hour. See if we can get him out there and get a goal for him. That'd be nice. Like I said, uh, Jerry, Jerry Peters has become a bit of a, an essential bit part player in the team this year. Um, chipped in with goals and assists when needed. And, uh, and in times like this, when he's been getting opportunity to the shine in the past, he's come on and done well. Rightio. He's, he's in with the shout here. I'd like to see Rubio get that hat trick though, however. Right, Vlentnik. Oh, he's kicked by Rui, and Rui is sent off. Rui is gone. He is out of there. And that is a GG. Absolutely for us. Well, we've got all the players out there. We can. We've rotated as much as we can. We shouldn't have gone in with such a strong lineup, perhaps. But it is what it is. And 9.9 .9 for Rubio. He's just a fraction off getting himself a perfect 10. Well done, lads. Good stuff. Good stuff. Hmm. What are we going to come back to here? Um, every one of these matches is important. Like, this is important. This is probably less important now after that. This is important. This is important. Like, like we need to win all of these. We need to beat all of these boys here. Hmm. I'll have a think about it. I guess you'll find out when you see the thumbnail for the next episode. But that was a bit of overkill, wasn't it? Never mind, we'll learn from our mistakes. At least we can play a rotated side next time we run into them. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe if you're new here. And if you are new here, go check this video out here. It's where we start our journey with RFC Serang, which is the start of our Belgian career in the save. It's a good jump on point for the save and we'll get you all caught up to where we are now. My name's Wayland. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you next time.